Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Melania returns to Texas sporter and infuriates Dems again with what she wore this time. No matter what First Lady Melania Trump does, she just can't win with the left, and understandably, I don't think she cares. The last time she headed to the Texan border with Mexico, she wore a fun young jacket that said on the back, "I really don't care." Do you? She said it was just a jacket, and I believe her. Every time Melania wears heels or an outfit of any sort, the left loses it and spins it as something nefarious. It's insane. This time she went to the border and wore a simple black and white outfit, which infuriated the Dems all over again. This time because there was pretty much nothing to criticize. They wanted something to trash her in the media for. Melania is always the epitome of class and dresses to the nines. The left hates her for her beauty, grace, and kindness. They show it every time they can. Melania's greatest sin this time was not being part of the media spectacle. She is in this for the children and she genuinely cares about them. Something the leftists cannot relate to. Melania has real compassion for these children and wants to be involved in making sure they are taken care of and treated well. The First Lady does not go out of her way to send messages like the left does. If anything, her original jacket told the media she doesn't care what they think of her and I think we can all relate to that. In a clean cut and simple white slacks and a black blouse, Melania went about visiting centers where children were housed after their parents were apprehended at the U.S.-Mexican border. She did not release details on her plans probably to foil attempts by the vulturistic press to hound her during her visits. Her first visit was only a week ago to the border town of McAllen, Texas. She met with officials there who were dealing with detained families. She also took time to meet with children and encourage them. That's what a first lady does and Melania does it very well. So many things are happening here in the U.S. and internationally, it makes your head spin. But what does the media focus on? Melania's wardrobe. It's just dumb. The First Lady's spokeswoman said it was just a jacket, with no hidden message, but the left ran with it anyway. President Trump supported Melania by tweeting that his wife was saying she really doesn't care about the fake news media. It could have been either one and you know what? It doesn't matter. It means nothing in the scheme of things and it just shows how hyper-reactive the media is. The media is still ranting over children being separated from their parents at the border. As I understand it, most if not all of them have been reunited and this blow-up is another piece of fake news. A federal judge on Tuesday ordered that thousands of migrant children and parents be reunited within 30 days and sooner if the youngster is under five. Trump is already doing that and that ruling was pure grandstanding. And what would a media outrage be without Michelle Obama sticking her nose where it does not belong? She was speaking recently at an event in New Orleans, Louisiana. It was during that talk that Michelle brought up her time as First Lady while taking a mean jab at Melania. I couldn't make those kinds of, fashion, mistakes, I was outstanding, said Michelle. Time tweeted, making mistakes was not an option. Michelle Obama on the pressure of being the first. That is the most arrogant statement I have ever heard from a First Lady. Just wow. First off, Michelle Obama should be taking fashion lessons from Melania. I didn't care for Michelle Obama's style at all. What she said about Melania's fashion choice was just laughable and is enough to tick anyone off. She has a selective memory if she thinks that she ever looked better than Melania Trump. One simple little message on a jacket sent everyone reeling. Michelle hardly had that effect on anyone. I think she's really jealous of Melania. She can't quit talking about Melania and trashing her. That's just sad. And remind me again. Did Michelle Obama ever once go to the border? Nope, she didn't and her husband incarcerated twice as many children as President Trump and Obama used cages. Michelle attacks Melania because she has no legacy as First Lady and she knows Melania will leave an incredible legacy when she leaves the White House. Melania Trump will leave memories of kindness and a love for children in her wake. She takes the time to go to the border or to areas hit by calamity and she actually works with people to help them. I don't recall ever seeing Michelle Obama do that in the eight years she was in the White House. I do remember her saying she was ashamed of her country and that she hated being in the White House. But her meddling in school lunches pales in comparison to the charitable actions by Melania. Fashion-wise, there is literally no comparison. Melania is in a whole other category from Michelle. As far as making mistakes, Michelle made many of them and her attire was right at the top of the list. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.